20-year-old Maddie Adams thought she was clear of leukemia, but nearly six months after her first diagnosis, it came back. Now she'll undergo a bone marrow transplant later this month. Her sister is a match, but she's going to need blood and a lot of it. When you're really sick, you can get up to five, six black, uh, bags a week. And I mean, with all the COVID stuff going around, nobody's wanting to donate. So things are running low. She's going to need like six to eight bags of blood and three units of platelets per week after her transplant. That's just one case. Melanie Smith has walked this path, diagnosed at age three, battling the disease, needing and using the blood. She was a special voice here at WDSU on the Children's Miracle Network telethons, raising money and awareness. She and her family have stepped up once again to urge Covington area residents to donate blood for Maddie and for all those in critical need right now. People are needing that blood and they're also needing antibodies. So. Um, they are testing your blood for antibodies, so say you have that in your blood, you can use that as a life-saving treatment to save somebody who is on a ventilator or something with COVID-19. You can't do it by yourself. You need blood from the community, you need prayers from the community, and then you can overcome this thing. So, Maddie, Mel, and family setting up with the blood center for a drive this Wednesday at the Bogafalaya Hall here in Covington. A chance for the community to step up and give back. It's safe to come and give blood. You know, it, you're saving a life, and it's definitely needed. There's so many people in this nation that need blood, and you know, the only way they can get it is from other people at blood drives. So, time to roll up your sleeves.